Tavern Keeper waves you over. In you, that way that only Tavern Keepers can do. Welcome in. Welcome to Izzy's Fizzies, where all liquids consumed on premises are just soda and nothing else. <gasps> are you the new fate maker who fought off all them skeletons? Don't know about that hero stuff, but I sure broke some bones. Well, thanks for nothing. Half the town was barricaded in here, and they were slurping down Virgin Shirley temples like it was the end of the world. I'm only judging you, fate maker. You did us a mighty fine favor. Now, out of thanks for saving our city, let me avail you of our amenities here in the Soda Tavern. Here's a magical quick change kiosk if you need to change anything fundamental about your entire being. It's free, weirdly enough. who might need your help out there in the world. Some of them hang out here in the soda tavern. Some put up posters around the city. It's been so busy, and I've been pulling non-alcoholic pints all on my own today. Oh, listen to me, lip flapping while you could be off adventuring. Have a busy day. Fate maker, uh, got a little surprise for you. The queen is so impressed that she wants to knight you. Ha! Bloody congrats! Come meet us in the main square. All right, we did Valentine's dumb quest stuff. Let's go pillage the countryside. I want some loot. What? Heroes don't pillage? No, we're almost done with the quest. I want to see what happens. Yeah, you would. Majesty Queen Butt Stallion is naming you a Knight of the Realm! I'm done being told how my story goes. Your master's age of heroes is over, and soon her whole world will follow. felt so sure is now fragile and broken. Still, one truth remains standing amidst the wreckage. The forces of evil must be stopped. Uh, okay. 
So, uh, a great, big, booming sound rings out. Great hells! What now? It's coming from beyond the docks! Come on, Fate Maker! I fear your work is not done yet. She loved me with all her glittering heart. I miss her so much! has awoken. What is a pyramid? The Dragon Lord's dark citadel across the ocean. Now that he has the sword, he'll be able to take the soul energy of every living thing in the Wonderlands. Without the Queen, our fates are sealed. Hey, ask him if we're still getting knighted. Fret, we're in mourning. Uh, you are in mourning. I'm getting that sir in front of my name. This is awkward, but am I still getting knighted? Only our queen had the power to bestow a knighthood. But you do deserve an honor for what you've done and what must come next. Kneel, fate maker. Or just crouch if your knees hurt. <clears throat> As regent defender of Brighthoof, I name thee. Squire of the realm. Squire? Man, that's some dragon dookie. I know it's not much, but it'll have to do. For your new quest is none other than to save the Wonderlands itself. Journey to the Pyramid. Take back the Sword of Souls and avenge our queen. You'll need a vessel. Speak with the Dockmaster. Whatever resources we have are at your command, Fate Maker. Paladin Mike is suddenly the most powerful man in Brighthoof. I should send him some tea. Ha! Ahoy to you, Squire of the Realm! Ahoy! In a ship. One that's not on fire. Let us begin construction post-haste. Come and craft your new vessel here at the dock. have never seen such a beauty of the seas. She's a wreck. Nonsense. I dub her the good ship Balsanya. Wait. Before you cast off, you must get the ship blessed by a bard, or you'll be pulled down to a watery grave by Drill, whose chains are the sea. What? But we're so close to taking off. I don't want to deal with sea curses. That's just how it works, man. Gotta follow the rules or get cursed round. Unfortunately, our resident bard disappeared in the invasion. That's why music's a fool's errand. If the armed guards fell to the undead, what chance did a man with a loot stand? What? No, he fell in love with a skeleton and they eloped. There is one other man who can bless your ship, though he is only a half bard. Still, he may now be your only hope for crossing the ocean. I last saw the half-bard heading into the Weepwild's dankness. If you return from those woods, find him, if he yet still lives. Ooh, the Weepwild. Sounds dangerous. In a good way. Yeah. It's a big old magical forest to the Sorth of Brighthoof. Uh, sorry. Did you say Sorth? Yeah, you know, fantasy directions. Nerf, Sorf, Inks, and Wibbles. Did you read any of the badass tone? I looked at the pictures. There was Sword Guy and Big Knife Guy. Wait, 
Are those the same guy? No, 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 wait. Don't spoil it. Hey, dance fam! Hello! Tina, you left a cheese curl on the board. What? No, I didn't. It's right there. It's in the way of our character. Well, uh, maybe it's not a cheese curl. Mayhaps it is a, uh, a, a powerful ancient meteor that fell from the heavens millennia ago. And it's got a lock on it. So you gotta go to a dungeon that I totally already had ready to get the key to unlock it. Uh-huh.
We unlock the cheese curl. As you put the key into the lock, the the powerful ancient meteor begins to rise from the ground. Woo! Returning to the heavens from whence it came. You're really not going to admit you dropped that on accident, are you? I have no idea what you meant. 